Where are we going, Sam? Back to Brady Culture's home for former child stars. Oh, okay. The form only fits in the slot at Brady Culture's home. Come on, little buddy. There's justice to be served. Can we get ice cream afterwards? Justice makes me hungry. This reminds me of that place where Aunt Trudy lives with the medicine smell and the rubber sheets and the enormous mute Indian. Sounds like a million laughs. Yeah, mostly after medication time. Where is everybody? Pulchritude above doubts. This is Culture's Clubhouse. Jumping Lawn Cheney in a boffo fright wig. Brady Culture, I presume. You know who I am? Wow! Evil plans really do work. Don't get too excited, Stretch Pants. The freelance police are here. Yes, actually. I've been waiting for you. Really? Next time try leaving the front door open. Save us all some grief. Allow me to explain. <coughs> Uh-oh. I think we just triggered a soliloquy. Good thing I have the attention span of a pint of yak butter. I never wanted much. Just to be universally loved, that's all. And to be number one in the TV ratings for the 1971 fall season. But no, those worthless hacks, the soda puppies, with their matching shirts and their cute little jingles, they came on opposite me and stole my audience. I was never offered another role. And now you two vigilantes won't even let a poor, down-on-his-luck actor mass-hypnotize the entire viewing public to become his worshipful fans forever. How cruel. Is it over? I think so. So? Oops. Since you've ruined the beautiful irony of having my arch rivals run my promotional campaign, I'm afraid you'll just have to take their places. In your dreams, culture! No, my friends. In yours. Hey, that tickles! Become Video Delivery Man. What? What's happening? Oh no. Oh no! What are you doing? I, I don't know. I... You were in on it all along! I told you it was a conspiracy! I told you! But then you already knew, didn't you? No, Bosco. I must deliver videos. Call the CIA! Call Interpol! Call Mickey Rooney! Must deliver Mickey Rooney videos. <laughs> I must deliver videos. I must deliver videos. I must deliver videos too far. Too far. Oh, don't even try. I love that part. Uh-oh. Either I just walked into the Salvador Dali Memorial Wax Museum, or I'm dreaming. You love me. You adore me. Become... Video Delivery Man. Do my evil bidding and so forth. 
<laughs> Holy brains in a blender. I'm still hypnotized. If only I could remember what Sybil told me to do. Destroy the intruder in your dream. Oh, yeah. Hey, Sam, I'm up here. Oh, hi, little buddy. Brady stole my body. I hate when people do that. You gotta get me down from here. Okay, little guy, I'll save you. Wonder what would happen to the picture quality if I gave this a tug. No! I must be on TV for all eternity! No! Oh yes, that's much better reception. Brady's stolen Max's body. Oh, and it feels good too. I just love my new furry paws and cute little tail. Hey, don't touch my tail, you psychopathic body stealer! Ooh, just let me at him! may not show it much, but I love you, Sam. Now go wash my car. I will be number one in the ratings, now and thanks to Cable for all eternity. What is this thing? Sweet rodent eating disorders, that is one fat rat. It's just a dream, Sam. Weird. Strange. That doesn't even work in a dream. I will be universally loved by everyone in the universe. <laughs> in your dreams. It's Brady culture in a light socket? The light bulb represents wisdom. And here's a little now. Brady culture is a perfect 10. Enigmatic. Not even in a dream. <laughs> you can't shoot me. I'm incandescent. That would hardly be sp Brady culture has a nice ring to it, doesn't it? I think someone needs to turn the lights out on your career, Brady. What? No! Oh, that Brady culture. He turns the world off with his smile. What is this doing here? Hey, it's loose. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> that was the most fun I've had since I lost my body. Let's do it again, Sam! Hmm, what now? Yay! <laughs> that was great! But Sam, if you'll notice, I'm right back where I started. Okay, hold on. I'll think of something. Didn't hurt. <laughs> Why am I lugging around a coat hanger again? Please, Sam, put it back on the TV. I'm begging you. That doesn't even work in a dream. Not even in a dream. I wouldn't want to turn Brady back on. Queer. Odd. Didn't hurt. <laughs> Thank you.
interesting. Dance, puppet, dance. I love my hair, and you do too. It's just a dream, Sam. I don't want to pop him. That doesn't even work in a dream. Weird. Strange. Enigmatic. I will have legions of... I am Brady Culture, and you are... Hey, Brady Cheese. What is it, fool? I'd like to introduce you to a little friend of mine. No! The cheese must stand alone! No! <laughs> and another one bites the cheese. Whoa! Whee! <laughs> Yay! <laughs> I'm right back where I started. Okay, hold on. I'll get you. Whee! Whoa! Gotcha! Oh, Mr. Culture, I have a surprise for you. Really? For me? No! <laughs> oh, my. Thanks, Sam. A little stringy, but good. Oh, I just remembered. I'm supposed to be somewhere. Bye, Max. He's awake! We're done for! Save the girlish histrionics, Bosco. I'm all right. Hmm... I was merely the victim of your garden variety video delivery hypnosis scheme. Okay, but what about your co-conspirator? My co-conspirator? Holy underpants draped to the mast of a sinking pork rind freighter! That hirsute egomaniac kidnapped my little buddy! Any idea how I can curtail this culture crisis? Brady culture. Ah, bow man. Uh, stay away from him. He's got it in for me. Sorry, Bosco. No can do. I've got to save my furry little pal. I don't suppose you have a Bosco Tech device that stymies hypnosis-inducing energy beams. Oh, a, a hypnosis blocker? 
Yeah, I thought about making one of those, but I wouldn't even know where to begin. I've got to find something quick. Thanks, Bosco. Do me proud. There's no time for that. I've got to rescue Max. Doc, Max is gone. Well, most of us outgrow our imaginary friends eventually. No, that megalomaniac Brady Culture's got him. I see. Of course. Hang on. Were you implying that Max is imaginary? I wasn't implying anything, though he does seem a little improbable. You see him too, though, right? True, but then I'm a psychotherapist. I've got to find some way to block a hypnotic ray. I don't suppose you, as a brain specialist of sorts, would know anything. Uh... <laughs> Great suffering lab rats, you do know something. Out with it, before my synapses fuse into a milky puddle of slag. Well, it's a gross breach of doctor-patient privilege for me to even tell you about it. But one of my more technologically inclined patients drew me a diagram of a contraption he claimed will block hypnosis. That's just the sort of ridiculously lucky break I need. It's a huge violation of every reasonable code of ethical conduct, of course. But you being a policeman of sorts, I suppose it's okay to give you the diagram. Hmm, my lack of solid engineering background has finally caught up with me. I can't make any sense of this. I'd love to help, but engineering is one of the few fields I haven't tried. Sorry. Max isn't going to like it when he finds out I ruined our reception. I've got to tell him as soon as possible. Hey, Bosco. You okay? Yep. Thanks, Bosco. Do me proud. Bosco, take a gander at this. What is it? A death threat? Even better. It's instructions for the latest in Bosco tech innovation. Hmm. Well, let's see. A colander of that. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I could build this. Just need one thing. What's that? Something for that antenna thing at the top. Antenna, got it. Will a make-do antenna do as a make-do antenna? Yeah, okay. Let me just add a little Bosco Tech Innovation. And here it is. The most sophisticated hypnosis blocking helmet the world has ever seen. Happy days are here again. Uh-oh, it seems like the old moolah gauge is running on empty. Ah, take it. Just stop that Brady culture. He's got it in for me. You're a credit to dementia, Bosco. You'll have to pay for the next one, though. I'm coming, Max. Rule number three, always wear protection.
Hand over the Lagomorph culture. Sam! Boy, am I glad to see you. Johann Sebastian here only knows how to play one song. What's this, a rerun? Didn't we just see the dog getting hypnotized episode? <laughs> well, if you really want to watch it again... What? Another triumph for skanky ingenuity and ordinary kitchenware. Give it up, culture. Your quiche is cooked. Time out for the cavalry! You've colored outside the lines of the law, Brady culture. We see you! And this time we Going are... to get hypnotized again. <laughs> I'm sure you all remember the commands I taught you. So now, my foolish pawns, attack the dog! Ow! Attack the videotapes! Buffoons! Attack the dog! <laughs> Become Brady Culture. <laughs> Do my evil bidding. Worship the videotapes. What nonsense. Attack the dog. Ow. Worship me. No, me, me, worship me. You're my minions, mine. Attack me! No! Me! Attack me! Me, me, me! Yes! Oops! No, wait! I mean... Oh. Smart hey, move, hey. Sam! You played oh. him like a two-dollar glockenspiel! I learned all my best tactics in the first grade. I tried to send you semaphore signals with my ears, but you know how I always get the K and the V mixed up. You crack me up, little buddy. Well, I guess we should dehypnotize these poor saps again and be on our way. Let me! You know how I adore gratuitous violence. Well, that's that, Max. Another boot to the pasty ass of crime. Thank goodness this whole hypnotic mind control thing didn't go any further. That could have been really annoying. It's great to be on your show, Myra. I'm a huge fan. I just can't seem to stop watching for some reason. Little people's face and wisdom, so the papa's more than this. 